One of the most important parts of making a video is audio quality. While most cameras come with built-in audio recording, the quality is often poor and restricts the freedom the camera has to capture a variety of shots. Using a separate external audio recorder can make all the difference in how your video will sound. Syncing sound simply means lining up your separate audio file with your video file so they match up. It is an easy process, but it can make all the difference in the quality of your video. Today, we'll explain the process of capturing quality sound for your videos using external recording devices and the process of syncing up your video and sound files in post-production using Final Cut Pro. Most people don't realize that sound is two-thirds of what makes a good video. People can get accustomed to seeing low-quality video as long as the sound is good. But low-quality sound can be pretty distracting, even with good video. Notice how distracting it is when the audio isn't perfectly lined up with the image. The difference is still visible when the audio is out of sync by one or two frames. There are many benefits to recording a separate audio file with your video. Notice the difference in quality between the audio from our external audio recorder and the camera's internal audio recording. An external recorder gives you more control over which microphones you can use and specific audio settings such as gain and panning. This can be useful if you are shooting something at a long distance. You can set the camera up far away and still get good audio. An external audio recorder frees up the camera from the audio equipment and can allow the camera more range of motion without all the cumbersome wires. Separating the audio equipment from the camera equipment can also be important for action shots where there is a lot of camera movement. This way, the audio recorder does not have to worry about following all the camera movements or about giving enough slack to all the wires to prevent equipment damage. Recording a separate audio file also gives you the extra security of a backup file in case there are problems with your audio equipment. It is important to take the proper steps during production to set up your audio for syncing in post-production. First, you should consider the type of equipment you will need for the shoot. There are a range of different microphones and audio recorders that are specific to different shooting conditions. For this video, we're using the Fostex DCR302 with a Rode Shotgun microphone. For information on how to use the Fostex, refer to the ISS Fostex tutorial video, which we've linked to in our information section. For other questions about equipment, contact the ISS Media Center at one of our campus locations. It's important to remember when recording that you'll have both a video and an audio file. Don't forget to hit record on your audio recording device as well as your camera. Slating at the beginning of each recording can make it much easier to sync up your audio in post-production. When the slate clicks together, it creates a large spike in the audio waveform that is easy to recognize. You can line up the spike from the audio file with the spike on the camera's internal audio that accompanies the clip to get accurately synced sound. Slates contain other important information about the clips you're shooting, including the shot name, scene number, and take number. Having a readable slate at the start of each clip can make it much easier to organize your clips in post-production. If you do not have an actual slate, you can achieve this spike with a loud, sharp clap. Make sure your slate or hands are visible in the shot and click your slate clearly. This makes it possible to sync the audio file with the visual click or clap in the video as well. Once you have your audio and video files uploaded, you can sync them in post-production using Final Cut Pro or any other video editing software. Most video editing software can sync up audio for you. To sync audio in Final Cut Pro, hold down the Shift key and click on the video file and audio file you would like to synchronize. Right-click and select Sync Audio. Final Cut Pro will use the spike from your audio file and your camera's internal audio to sync up the clips in the timeline it will create a single synchronized file with both the audio and video. You can manually synchronize the audio by lining up the audio waveforms in the timeline. Drag the video file into the timeline and then bring in the separate audio file below. The audio will anchor onto the clip. Then you can drag the green audio clip to match the blue waveform below the video clip so that the spikes match up. As an added guideline, you can increase the volume on both the audio and video clips to hear the sound match up. Once you have lined up your clips, 
mute the audio on the video file. For more information on syncing audio, contact the Instructional Support Services at one of our campus locations.